everything is working. Perfect. Well, thank you to be here at Ubucon. Uh, yeah, I've been waiting for this event uh, for a year. So I'm glad you were all here. Um, so I was already introduced, so I guess I don't need to introduce myself. So I will start uh, this talk by um, uh, describing, by explaining what, what, what is my experience inside uh, the Ubuntu French local team. Um, so Ubuntu FR, what is Ubuntu FR? If you look online and you, find, and you search on uh, ima image engine, you might find some uh, weird stuff, you know, uh, because we do plenty of stuff. Uh, some are funny, and sometimes you can just uh, end with some uh, weird uh, horses pictures. So Ubuntu FR is a local team, a local community team. Um, so what does that mean, being a team? Team, 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 team. So uh, if you go to the local port, uh, if you go to the local dot local dot ubuntu dot com, uh, you might find the French local team, uh, which has some issue with the French language at the header, as you can see. Uh, so this is us. You can find other local team uh, nearby uh, you. Um, we are doing a lot of stuff. Uh, we have online uh, activities like having a forum for support stuff, uh, people asking questions, or can I um, fix this? in their own language, because askubuntu.com is mainly English. And some people uh, are not friendly with this in the French-speaking community. Uh, we have a lot of other activity, uh, obviously. But I will focus on events. And before uh, showing what we are doing and what you could do uh, and what you should do, uh, I will just um, give you a simple uh, highlight you should try organizing events. Really, do it. Uh, okay, let's start. So I will start with, maybe you have heard of this. It's called Ubicon. So there are Ubicon everywhere in the world, almost. And in Europe, we do, we do uh, Ubicon Europe every year. So um, I will let uh, Poppy and other people to explain you what what is a Nubucon actually. Not sure it's working. The song and it's laggy. Awesome. Uh, what is Ubuntu and why Ubuntu? So, um, since the Ubuntu project started, there have been regular events, in-person events, uh, which were called developer summits, uh, UDS for short. And UDS was where the Ubuntu developers would get together and plan the next release. So we would put a release out in April and a release of Ubuntu out in October. And then shortly after it, a few weeks later, we'd have an Ubicon at uh, UDS and we'd plan the next release. Those got really, really big and we started iterating faster in our development. So we decided, okay, we're, instead of doing it twice a year in person, we're going to do it more often online. So we switched everything to online, and while that did all the, the technical side of it, you know, we did all the planning that we needed to do. And we noticed that we missed the in-person events, and that's partly why the Ubercons um, started, is so that we could have these in-person presentations and you know, interviews in a corridor and you know, things like this that, that you just can't get on you know, Hangouts at IRC. And it's, it was so popular that we did it again and again, and it's, it's grown so that this year, uh, it's two days, two tracks, many speakers, and it's just sort of a, a way for people who really love Ubuntu, and some are and some aren't tech enthusiasts. They can get together and uh, hang out with other people who love Ubuntu, learn more, and just sort of have fun. So an UbuCon is typically a community-run Ubuntu event, um, so community members get together to organize it. Uh, they bring in pres presenters from their country or area, 
um, and then they run an Ubuntu conference uh, for the users. You know, like having this kind of involvement is great. And how can we turn that up, you know, so that as well people knows more about the project, know, you know, like we communicate and so on. We had some in Germany, we had some in Florida, in France, all over the place, Latin America. Um, and they're, they're just fantastic. Like, um, what's really nice is that it brings together so many people. Um, and it's not just canonical people or just community people or just people like partners. It brings together everyone. UbuCon this year, uh, you know, it's co-conference with Scale, and so we're here. we came here for Scale, but we were very happy that the uh, the two days before Scale proper, there was the UbuCon event, and uh, for this event, we a lot of the attention and a lot of the keynotes have gone to uh, Snappy and um, Ubuntu's convergent vision, which fits in really nice. Of course, I'm going to plug my own project here with Mycroft because uh, you know some of our goals are to get Mycroft on uh, embedded devices, which Snappy helps with, but also on the Ubuntu phone. Would you recommend anyone uh, watching us to join an UbuCon or maybe make their own one? Yes, on both. I think definitely go to an UbuCon. Um, these events are amazing. Um, they're fun, they're invigorating, they're educational. They're just a great time. I mean, I've had a, such a wonderful time since I've been here. They're a lot of fun. We get to meet a lot of people, and uh, you learn some stuff during during the talks. That's that's always fun. Um, but also, we have parties afterwards. We get together. You get to have lunch with people. <laughs> yeah, it's it's a lot of fun. Um, and definitely get involved too. It's, it's a perfect opportunity to get to know people, to um, interact, to to um, also uh, witness other teams, like stuff you haven't even seen before. See how they work. Um, What's new there? If you can get to that, go to that. It's definitely worth it. If you're in the U.S. and you can get to UbuCon at scale, it's definitely worth it to travel here and go to that. They always, all the UbuCons I've been involved with, they always need volunteers. So if you want to help out, if you want to run a camera, if you want to help find speakers or sponsors, there's always work to be done. But if you can set one up, even better. I mean, there's a lot of work involved. But I think if you're interested in setting up an event, uh, I think that's a great way to do it. Go to UbuCon. Ubercon.org, I think it is. Um, you can find out more and reach out to the community team at Canonical. They can help. Some people such as David Pinella and Daniel uh, Holbach and Michael Hall, people like that. So, definitely. I, I can't wait to see you next Ubercon. <laughs>
on rencontre les gens qui sont intéressés par le logiciel libre, ils passent, on discute. C'est un week-end entier sur pour faire découvrir tout. C'est trop cool, So yeah, the video was not the thing here. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, so what happening in Ubuntu Party? You have different uh, uh, area. Uh, you have some uh, showcase. Uh, for example, you can showcase Ubuntu to people. They can try, or you can showcase Ubuntu on phones, uh, Ubuntu Touch. Um, you can have install party. That means people can came with their PC, their laptop, whatever, even their phone, and they can back home with Ubuntu install uh, with a dual boot. By default, we install LTS on dual boot. But if you want to take more risk, you can do. But often, people who need uh, assistance to installing Ubuntu, they are not really aware of what is LTS or not. So my My tips here is install LTS. You don't want people to have a uh, uh, not uh, updated system after a few months. Uh, you have an um, association booth, uh, kind of uh, what you can see in the other part of your book on. Maybe you, you have the time to win there. Uh, we often have um, um, youngness and educational and gaming area for uh, the The younger, the youngest of us, uh, so you can uh, basically play a game on Linux, but you can also learn how to program with Scratch or anything. There are a lot of uh, workshops for that. So yeah, there is talk obviously beside workshop, and yeah, and of course people can put their hand on Ubuntu. They don't know what is it, but they cross by the hall. They see the light, what is, what is happening here? Oh, I will have a try. They put the hand on the keyboard and the mouse, and they, have a, they can play a game. Maybe I, I can try to go to the internet. Oh, it's simple, that was the Firefox logo, I know that one. And yes, this operating system seems to work. So this needs maybe, uh, it needs a, a lot of, um, Our team, you need a, a lot of uh, volunteers to do this event, but you can, you can, you, excuse me, you can just pick one of those uh, sub activity, and it could be an event. So you don't need all the volunteers. If your local team is just small, you don't need to make a big thing. You can start with maybe just talk and I don't know, try Ubuntu on the PC, and when you grow, you can add more events. But you will need volunteer for that. So. Don't expect to to carry everything on your own shoulder. Yeah, it's uh, it's some work, you know. Um, after we got the web cafe, did you heard about that web cafe Ubuntu? Okay, I have a video. <laughs> Come on, I will try. Um, because I think uh, it was to see the picture, so I I hope it won't be laggy, because the pictures you the frame you will see in the video. Uh, it will really, uh, you will feel uh, what is happening there. So I will explain a bit later after you see the, the thing because it's easier for me when you see already the thing. Come on. It's not working. Okay. Okay. I think I cannot stop it.
have an eye uh, on this. It was the last video, I hope. I don't know if I will be able to. Oh, it's working. So we saw a lot of things. So Web Cafe, basically, we have a big booth, a, a big stand in a music festival, in different music festival. And we have some PC put on some desk. And people can come in and have a try. They put the hand on the PC. Oh, it's working. I can go on the internet. By the way, they often have issues with network in a music festival because there is many people here. And the uh, um, 4G antenna just get down. It's not working anymore. So we have a lot of people come in because they need, for example, to find their, uh, they're sharing a car with someone to get back home. So they need internet, maybe. So people come for internet, but some people just come because maybe you have seen we have some uh, distraction uh, animation like uh, having a tattoo on yourself. So people just because it's fun. Um, we also have, may I, I, sh I told you at one moment, uh, have a look on this. You see a big blue box. It's almost the same as the small black box, uh, uh, the, the GIF box or GIF box, I never know how to say in English. GIF, GIF, and um, well, there is this GIF, GIF box uh, over there, so you can have a try. So basically people uh, come in the group and they take pictures and as they push the button, they have pictures and they can download the, the GIF, the GIF, and they can share it with the hashtag uh, Web Cafe Ubuntu and that's it. So. PC you can try, tattoos, uh, and of course we talk with people, people ask some questions, um, and the GIF box, well, we had an issue, hardware issue, we, at that time we had uh, no IR uh, cam, but yeah, we can do GIF. Um, so this is the same GIF box you can try there. Have a try, it's fun, and uh, don't forget to share it. So now let's talk about science and we do some analyze about what's happening there. So as you can see, there is a lot of things cool happening. There are unicorn in Web Cafe. This is awesome. And what is also awesome, people are having fun. Everybody is smiling because they are here to have fun. It's a music festival. So you have to, to be with this. So if you stand like that, waiting people coming, it's not, you know what I mean? You, you need to have a team that are aware of this uh, kind of situation. And also you, not, you need to be aware with this. Uh, people are a music festival and they have, uh, we, we say apéro in French, uh, they just have a drink and drink. So, you also have to know how to behave with those kind of people. So if you're afraid, because it will happen. Uh, I'm not going to lie with you. This happen. It's not a big thing. You just ask to people to, to not put um, um, not sweet for work content on the PC, and that's all. And to not smoke inside the booth. But yeah, it's not just uh, everything is wonderful. You have just something to, 
to worry about. Um, we also have booth. Uh, so this, for example, uh, it's a stand in a festival that also have a music festival inside, but there is a sub area, which is a booth area, as you can see, and this is the, not the hackerspace area, but the, all the techie stuff. They put all the booths of the techie stuff in this area, so we are having a booth and people come here. Uh, they have a PC they can try. You can see the screen, maybe. Oh, it's working. <laughs> um, yeah, so this is a very good thing to, to, to have in your community because when you do an event like that, somewhere not in your city, you will meet people, of, of course. Some will ask, oh, can I join the team? And you should answer, yes. You would like to help me to host this town? Do you live close to this city? And this is how you make uh, other city in your area to help you to join the, the community. Uh, that's what we are trying to do. For example, for the web cafe, we are a lot of Parisian going because we are, uh, I think, the most active part of the French local team. But there are some people in Brittany where is are the almost all music festival where we go. And talking with them and making them active and making join the team of volunteer, well, they feel in the team, so you are more in the team, so it's getting easier because you have less thing to do. So this is a good thing to expand in a way, but it's not on a short timing. It's, uh, it takes a few time to, to build it, but it's a good way, I think it's a strong way, because it's getting, oh, the annual, event where we meet this other uh, member of the community, so it forces you to meet. That's good. Um, one of my favorite, even if we don't do a lot of uh, them uh, nowadays, but I think we sh definitely should do that more often. Uh, it's almost the same that what will happen tonight. Uh, it's named Ubuntu Hour. We name it Pose Ubuntu. Uh, it can be anything. You just meet in a university in a room and you meet, meet up, or you can go to a restaurant and uh, having some food or in the pub sharing drinks. And then you meet your local people. You can, <coughs> you can use a website like Meetup. Uh, there is, uh, I think there is still, we still have an account for all the local team or not, not anymore. Okay, so yeah, if there is an issue, just ask the local local com community council. Uh, they are very helpful, and they will redirect you to the right person if you need help. Um, so yes, those events are really cool because, yeah, like I said, you meet the people, you talk online to organize stuff, but there you meet and you don't have to you don't have to put a working item on the to do list. On the, on the topic of the event. It can be just be an event. Let's meet and have fun, you know? So you should have the, some of those events. Um, I could continue because there is a lot of kind of events, but I just wanted to give you an highlight of what you could do. Uh, and I just want you to remember, you really should try to organize event. Just do it. Okay. Um, and I will finish uh, with a small, um, a small promotion, uh, if you allow me. Uh, for four years, we are having a Nubucon, a ROP. The first one was in Essen. Then it was in... Paris, after that it was in Gijon, Asturias, no? Yes? Gijon. Gijon, and, and then it was here. And since the second Ubukan uh, Europe, uh, the French local team is um, using the Ubukan to announce uh, a new t shirt. So, uh, the first one was. This one, 
the bionic beaver. We name it. We rename it the badass bionic beaver. Uh, then the cosmic cuttlefish. I think there are a few units of them, maybe three or four. So, yeah. Um, the current one, Disco Dingo, and there is two colors of this one: the yellow one and the dark one, if you prefer dark. And the new design for the one Ermin, if you allow me. And all of those designs are made by a volunteer. Uh, well, the community uh, and the board, mostly the board of uh, Muntuefer, uh, vote or help to make some choice for the design. But all the things are mostly done by a volunteer, uh, which is uh, Charlotte. You might uh, meet her in the, the event if you want to meet the designer. So, yeah, that's it. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, if you are kitchen, uh, I will take those. Uh, have some questions. Yeah. Hi. Hi. Uh, how many people are there in the Ubuntu? FR community? Uh, do we have even numbers? I don't really know. Uh, I don't really know uh, because it's kind of special because we built uh, more than 10 years ago the association Ubuntu FR, but we use it just for having a, a board uh, limited for the, just to having a wallet. And uh, 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 not a physical person. Can we say moral person in English? No? I understand. So when you, you when you want to have a um, uh, an event here, instead of signing by your name, you can sign by the name of Ubuntu FR. So that's why we created the association just to have a, a wallet, a bank account, and yeah, not on the name of someone. Because if you leave, you got the donation of people. So say with the, so that was just the purpose. So everybody that go on the forum was considered that part of the community on IRC, you are part of the French community. So we just started uh, the membership of Ubuntu FR uh, years ago, but we don't promote it because it just allow you to vote for the next board member uh, list, but that's all. Um, but uh, when we do a Ubuntu party, for example, we have between 30 and 100 volunteers. Uh, yeah, in in Paris. Uh, yes, I don't know if it answers the question. I'm not sure. And also some from abroad volunteers. <laughs> Sorry. And also some volunteers from abroad. Um, yes. Yes, some people like uh, maybe you saw uh, Marco Costales in the Ubuntu Party video. Uh, this guy comes sometimes and help us, but he's not the only one. Uh, Fernando come also sometimes, and Jugo too. So yes, uh, anyone that come and help us is part of the community, I guess. How do people outside of France purchase your super awesome t-shirts? I, I didn't hear, sorry. Oh, right. Uh, so we decide to have um, an online shop, but instead of having our own online shop, we are sharing uh, an online shop with other French-speaking uh, uh, free software associations such as Debian FR, April, which is like a French uh, FSF, if I can, if I may say, and I think like what I which is kind of uh, EFF French, and so this the name of the share, the online shop is enventlibre.org. Um, I will tweet this maybe, and we have some flyers with the name of the website. But I will apologize in advance because the website is uh, parling français. So sorry for that. 
it's not it's not an English uh, website. Uh, it's in French, so you might need to translate. But you know, it's not really complicated. You find the image that looks like the T-shirt you want. You select the size. Um, you continue. That it. And if the website is not yet uh, translated, uh, it's uh, ship uh, worldwide. So, enventlib.org. Uh, I should have put it on the slide. Uh, yeah. This is not a question. A question. If you provide us the link, we can add uh, the link for the T-shirts in the infos page. Oh yeah, that would okay. be cool. Yeah. You just have to provide me one bionic because I order it. And it was never given to me, so I just have the Disco Dingo. We will talk after the, uh, about that. Perfect. Okay. Another way to get the t-shirts is to ask Dio Constantino because he, he gets them and then just delivers them. He has a special delivery service. Okay? Yeah, yeah. If, if you can find someone that come in Ubuntu party like Diogo, it's cool to ask him to bring your t-shirts so you you don't have to pay the fees. But you pay the time because he won't knock your door the next day. So know someone or just wait. And yeah, yeah. What's the password for the T-shirt? Is there a password? Yeah. So that I can order it. Right for now. the Wi-Fi, you mean? No, 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 for the T-shirt. I hope you say yes. Uh, well, this is a good question. Can you try to refresh the page? Okay, I'll try. <laughs> Are you on enventlib.org? Yeah. Or maybe f uh, use a, a search engine, because maybe there is a dash in enventlib somewhere. Yeah, w wait for the link. Any more questions? Well, uh, thank you again, and I hope you will uh, enjoy a good time uh, at Ubukam um, uh, Sintra. Um, yeah, thank you, everyone. <laughs>